Johnny Pilkenden. Johnny, when he's on form, awfully seemed to play that a little bit better. And that's his second point by the UCD students. St. Rhinus. Comes down towards Gary Carl. Oh, brilliant save by Michael Walsh. Excellent. Michael Keneally's great. Well done by Liam Gillard. This is, guess who? Johnny Pilkington. Liam McCarthy putting pressure on Offaly as DJ Carey. His first real opportunity. Forcing his way forward. Oh, yes. Excellent play by DJ. It might have been quite for 33 minutes. But just one little flash of inspiration and you can take it out. Well, he's been kept quiet for so long. He's, you know, it just shows the class that this player has. He just strikes just before half time on a vital stage. He's under pressure here, moving into a bad angle as well. But a brilliant shot across from Troy, giving him no chance. Fantastic goal by DJ Carey. Back to Prendergast. It's a good testing ball, Adrian Rowland. And Jim Troy is there. Oh! It almost went in. It was so close. But the umpires were right there. from the crowd up behind the goalman was that they all raised their umbrellas thinking that this was in but this time Anthony Prendergast puts it over the bar in towards Eamon Morrissey Brian Hennessy staying with him and still Eamon Morrissey comes back outside to DJ Carey and really this guy is a classy bit of stuff half chance and you can register a white flag green flag good point for Kilgetty Liam McCarthy Switching it in towards the middle. PJ Delaney. Stacking up the half chance. Good defending. But not good enough as that goes over the bar. PJ Delaney reduces Hoffley's lead to two points. As time ticks away, Eddie drops it in. DJ Carey underneath it. So too is John Power. Liam McCarthy. And it's Carey that has it. Hand passing it inside to John Powell. Putting his way forward. First to his way forward. Is that a penalty? The referee has his hand up in the air. Indicating that it is a penalty. Drama in Crook Park. Kilkenny have the penalty. Carey usually hits these at a ferocious pace. And it's got in. Kilkenny, the All-Ireland champions, are back in business.